Hello everyone! Welcome to the tournament! In this video I will explain how the tournament will look like and how can you improve at Shogi during this event. Useful web pages that I will be including in this video are Shogi.pl, Discord, 81 Dojo. Other helpful websites that I will cover are Time and Date and our Google Sheet. Each tournament round will consist of four steps. One which is pairings, then match arrangements, playing and PGA, and finally reporting and checking the results. Let's start with pairings. When the new pairings are ready, the organizer will send a Discord message pinging all the participants of the tournament to check the link. You can also access the tournament page going to shogi.pl going to Tournaments, turn it to Series, and choosing the tournament you belong to. The pairing table will look something like this. You will have the table number. You will have to find your name on one of those tables, and the person next to you will be your opponent. At first the result will be 0-0, zero, zero, and there won't be any link, but as the game is played at the end of the round, the winner will be shown in the bold text, the result will show who won, and there will be a link to the game. On the same page you will also be able to find the current standings. After you confirm who is your opponent, you can use those useful links to arrange your game. In this Google Sheet you can see all the information about all of the players. In order to find information about your opponent, you can click Ctrl F, type the name you're searching for, and once you find your opponent, you can check what types of what days he prefers to play the game at or their time zone. Using this information, it will be much easier to set up the game. In order to contact your opponent, you can send them a message directly or you can go to your tournament match arrangement channel and you can ping their name by copying their name from the Google Sheet. It will be the first Discord name. You can add the tag at so that you can ping them when you send the message. When you answer the message, you can right click on the message and click reply. This way your opponent will be pinged anytime you answer his message. It's a very useful thing to do. In order to find the pings more efficiently, you can use this button on top right. It's gonna show you all the pings along all the servers. But if you wanna just check the harbor, make sure you have harbor server open. Click mentions and you can filter it to include just this server. And once you click on it, you can quickly find where you were pinged. Occasionally the organizer will ping the whole tourney members, so remember to keep looking for those updates. Now if you have trouble contacting your opponent or you have trouble scheduling the game, you can contact the organizer um, you can ask for an extension, a day or two, so that you can play the game, or um, in case you both want, you can agree on a draw and both of you will get half a point. Of course, if one side makes no attempt to schedule the game, the other side will win by default, so make sure you schedule the game as quickly as possible. To make sure you do not mistake the time zones, you can take the time zone of your opponent, copy it, Ctrl plus C. You can go to the time zone converter, time and date website. You can Ctrl V or paste it here, select, and then you can input your city, your country, your time zone over here, and you can manipulate the time as well as the date to set up the game. You can propose the time zone to your opponent like this. You can also copy the link of this web page, it's gonna keep this information in it. Um, just make sure that you don't mistake the date because sometimes it happens 
that it's on a different date for your opponent than it is for your time zone. Once the date has been set up, make sure you log into 81 Dojo before the game starts. Make sure you don't get late, because um, if you get late to your game, your opponent might be rewarded an automatic win. Of course, if something happens, you can send a message to your opponent before the game uh, within reasonable time that you want to reschedule. But once the game is set up, make sure you appear on that time. One of the players will have to wait according the time for the tournament. So for example, turning to Masters will be rated game. So 15 minutes, one minute, and then start waiting. The other person will have to double click on the name and challenge. I won't be coming into details how 81 Dojo works. You can check my other video on that topic. Um, the most important is that after the game, you stay for the post-game analysis. Um, it is important that you compare what you and your opponent felt during the game, what were your thoughts. It's the best way to improve at Shogi learning from your opponent. When the game is finished, the winner needs to post the game result in specific format on the Discord. The loser will have to check if that result was posted and if it's correct. The link will be found um, on the, in 81 Dojo lobby after the game is finished. Or it can be found in your profile. Once you log in, you can click this more button, search for recent games, and then there will be your Kifu over there. You can copy it and include in the Discord message. To find the link, you simply open the game and the link of the game should be in your browser. The format in which you post the result will be something like this, including the pink name of your opponent, the correct result, and the URL error link afterwards. You have to include the number of the round and the acronym of your tournament. For example, TTJ, one, name of your opponent, result, your nickname, and the link. It's gonna look something like this. If you keep it in this format, it will help me to organize the results later on, so thank you for the cooperation. After one week, a round is finished and the organizer will uh, make a new pairing table, will make a new standing table on the webpage. We're going to ping you on the Discord, so make sure to check that the previous round results are correct and the whole process will begin once more with a new opponent. If you have any problem during any of those phases, remember you can always send a message to the organizer. What can you do to improve during the tourney? After checking pairing, you can research your, what your opponent plays and prepare for it. You can check their profile, look at the most recent games and prepare some countermeasure. Always be respectful toward your opponent. Even when you lose, you can learn from your mistakes during the post-game analysis. So after the game, always make sure to stay and chat with your opponent. If you're unsure, you can always bring your game to our Sunday streams. We're gonna have a segment especially for the tournament games on Sundays. Uh, we also will change the timing of the stream to 5 p.m. Zurich time so that more people can attend. I do recommend training Shogi in between the rounds, but remember to also take a break. Break is important for your uh, mental strength so that you can play the best Shogi. So remember, prepare, learn and have fun. Good luck in the tournament.